Hello out there, and a really quick video today with just a couple things that I wanted to talk about. The first one being that the $150 collection challenge video has already gotten just a lot of really great feedback. Um, I'm really excited about what I've heard and seen from people already, just the, um, the ideas and the perspectives and the different priorities that people have. You know, whether it was comments on Instagram or just on the video itself and a few people who have already made video responses. So I did actually make a playlist and it is like attached to my channel. So you can check out that playlist with all of the videos that are involved. And if you do happen to make a video, let me know and I will definitely link to it and um, and add it to our playlist so other people can, can check out your channel and, and your way of looking at that problem because it is an interesting problem and everybody has a different solution to it. And I'm just really enjoying that so far. So that's number one. Number two is that this video was supposed to be a first look video at the Spyderco Sliver Axe. And due to some miscommunication and some shipping issues, um, I received a different knife. And so the good news is that the Sliver Axe is on the way, but this different knife has to be returned. And I am going to put it on camera for just a second because it is another new Spyderco. And it came in this pouch. And I opened it just one time when I first got it, and I'm going to open it one more time right now. And then we are going to bag it up and put it away. And this is the One-Eyed Jack. And again, this was uh, mistakenly shipped to me, just a, a very new Spyderco S30V blade steel. Um, about as close to a custom piece as you can see this uh, really cool work on the spine. Um, about as close to a custom piece as you're going to see from Spyderco. So just very neat. The white G10, really reminiscent of this little Nalaka, which is also a 2017 release. And the One-Eyed Jack, um, the name of it comes from, there's two two jacks in a set of playing cards that have uh, only one eye. They're, they're profile pictures instead of facing like forward. And those are the heart and the, the spades, so that's why you have those G10 inlays. And while I don't really care for this knife, to be honest with you guys, don't really, don't really like the look of it. Um, the fit and finish is excellent, just from from what I've seen here. So, again, just wanted to get it on camera. Obviously, this is going to go to uh, to somebody else, and this is going to be their collectible piece, and it will be a neat piece in that right. Um, but yeah, just wanted to uh, to show you what you have there. A very nicely built knife. A little bit on the pricey side at 225, but if you are buying this knife, my guess is that this is going to be a, a gent carry and something that would get limited pocket time anyway because you would want to keep this pretty pristine. All right, but that's it, guys. I mean, I'm closing this knife up and it is going away and going um, back to the seller so that they can actually get it in someone's hands who wants to keep it. So that's exciting. Sliver Axe, like I said, on the way. Still got this Tangram right here that we're going to be talking about soon so that's what you can expect but yeah thanks for watching take care and like i said if you are interested in that 150 dollars challenge get involved it's a it's a really cool thing and it's been a lot of fun so far so uh take care and have a good one